What's going on, everybody? This is Patrick from Porter's Unboxings, as you know. I'm going to be doing my Money in the Bank predictions for this Sunday. And I cannot wait, guys. Fans are back! Great episode of SmackDown tonight. Um... You have in the opening package, it's been a year and a half, something is missing, and now it's back. The fans! So now, let's get in to one question that I have from my friend Michael. What are your recent pickups? Right here. I got Monday Night War that I am, I am in the middle of watching. So, back the DVD. Um, there will be a review of this coming soon. And it comes with insert. Let's go. And here's the disc that I'm going to put in the player now. And then my other pickup is What Killed the King of Pop, the inside story. Right there. And give me a minute here, messenger. Play that. So yeah. Those are my two. And now let's get to these predictions. Um, the first match is the pre-show. Rey Mysterio and Dominic Mysterio versus the Usos in the pre-show. SmackDown Tag Team Titles. Now, I thought this would be like on, I thought this would be like on, on the main show. But on the pre-show, really? Um I pick Rey Mysterio and, and, and Dominic to win this match. Um Mark Boy 316 just said um I just watched this video, and the Uso, Jimmy, he said, um, yeah, DUI, so, of, like, last week. So, of course, the Usos are not going to win this match. So, my pick is Rey Mysterio and, and Dominic. Um, I'm going to save the, um, the men's Money in the Bank match for... Later, as the last match, um, the um, the women's Money in the Bank is easy, actually, for me. Um, you have Asuka, Naomi, Alexa Bliss, Nikki Ash, who is Nikki Cross. Man, that superhero name is so dumb. What is she trying to be? Like, the Hurricane's daughter or something? Like, stop. Oh, and, um, WrestleMania 14 shirt. Um, Shawn Michaels versus Stone Cold. Um, yeah. Just stop it with this, this girl's name. Just, just let her go back to Nikki Cross. Um, versus Liv Morgan versus the returning Selena Vega. And you know her husband as Alistair Black or as M Malachi Black now. Made his debut in AEW about two weeks ago. So I, so I don't know why she returned. Versus Natalia And versus... Then the new spot that was open 
Tamina. So all these girls are, I mean, all these women, I'm sorry, are just placeholders. I, I mean, seriously, is this all your roster? I mean, so, I mean, seriously, this is all of the women's roster piled into one. You have Mandy Rose on SmackDown now. Mandy Rose. I'm, um, so I, I'm picking the one girl, the one woman that I think will actually win this thing. Liv Morgan. Selena Vega is just like, oh, so you're not going to hire my husband back, but you're going to hire me back. Yeah, I'm not going to have a match first to qualify for this. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to sign a piece of paper that's saying I'm in it. You're not going to win it. So, Liv Morgan is my choice. Since she, she has, like, TV time out of her contract, like, I, I get more TV time. I'm going in this match. So, Liv Morgan for the win. And now we go to... I don't believe the match in the night. But we're going with Bobby Lashley versus Kofi Kingston for the WWE Championship. Easy. Bobby Lashley is going to retain here. Um, because no one can stop the almighty Bobby Lashley. I, I, I'm just, I'm just so scared right now because, be, because I'm hearing over like on like websites that Goldberg is supposed to make a return. I'm sorry. What? Goldberg, the guy that. That's not it. Where is it? Hold on. There we go. The guy that made the fiend disappear in 2019, I mean, in 2020. No! We don't need this guy back! Please! Although he did get his ass kicked at, at, at um, Royal Rumble. So, thank you, Drew. But, please, no. L let, um, let Brock Lesnar come back. Please. But my pick is Bobby Lashley, hands down. Um, then we go to Rhea Ripley versus Charlotte Flair. Um, th this, rivalry, this rivalry has been trash. Rhea, Rhea Ripley for the win. I mean... She needs a win, right? Charlotte Flair has not... I mean, Rhea Ripley has not beaten her. Yet. You have WrestleMania 36. Yeah, that stupid triple threat match with Asuka. So, Rhea Ripley for the win. AJ Styles and Almos versus the Viking Raiders. Um, I'm picking AJ Styles and Almost to win this. First off, because no one is beaten Almost, and he's seven foot tall, seven feet tall. And like, as I imagine at SummerSlam, AJ Styles and Almost are going to lose to RK Bro. 
Randy Orton is going to come back. He is missing from Monday Night Raw for some reason. And he is going to come back, win the titles with Riddle, and it will be a good SummerSlam. So I'm picking AJ and almost to win because almost can't be beat. So, then we're going, hopefully, it will, will be the co-main event, or, or possibly the main event, Roman Reigns versus Edge. Oh, boy. I don't know. I mean, Edge has been dominant on... Smackdown. He's put the he's he's put the um, chair leg in the mouth of Jimmy, Jay, and Roman. I mean, he just made Roman Reigns tap out on SmackDown tonight. And like I mean, don't get me wrong, I love Edge to death. But, come on. Edge and Rollins are facing each other at SummerSlam. Seriously, they just said on SmackDown, I hope you win the title, Edge. So I can cash in and finish what I did to you seven years ago. Break your neck. With the curb stomp. Uh, so. I'm also seeing Roman Reigns win this as well. I mean hands down. Because. Because um, John Cena is supposed to come back for SummerSlam. And take the title from Roman. I'm hearing. So. I don't know. I'm 50-50 on this. So, then, I'm going to the hardest match I can predict. The money in the bank contract. Okay, so, I pick Roman for the win. Sorry, Michael. Now, on to the hardest pick the hardest match the, the money in the bank match you have ricochet john morrison riddle drew mcintyre biggie kevin owens king nakamura and formerly mr money in the bank from 2014 seth rollins Will he be a two-time Money in the Bank? I mean, I love to see it. I mean, he cashed in the heist of the century in 2015 at WrestleMania. Can can he do it again? I don't know. I, I know Ricochet and John Morrison are not winning it. Because they're going to have the spots of the match. Uh, you're... Um, th yeah, they're going to have, like, ladders thrown off. Jumped off, put through, and then Ke and then Kevin Owens is just gonna do a, a a swanton bomb off the ladders. Um. Yeah, I, yeah, I can't wait for this match, and I seriously cannot wait for this pay per view because fans are back. Y you can't do anything with it. You can't have a bad pay-per-view with fans. 
coming back after a year and a half. So I think the the poor match, in my opinion, is going to be the tag team title match, the Raw tag team title. That is just that's it, that's just going to be like this. But my pick is going to be Big E. Or Rollins. Now, with... This is Wrestling DVD Central's question. What is your f fantasy booking at, at Money in the Bank that you can see happening? Okay, so, that's actually a, a good question, Wrestling DVD Central. Um, I could see Big E w win the briefcase... And then Kofi Kingston winning the championship, but but in my fantasy, Big E cashing in on Kofi, and then like you have you have Xavier Woods already in Kofi's corner, so you have like the New Day, and then the New Day is over. Like, officially. Like, no more music, no more dancing. Big E has officially turned heel. Or, I could see Kevin... Or, I could see Kevin Owens winning this. And then cashing in on Roman. Or, I could actually see this happening as well. As I said, Rollins could win this match. And then, what I say to him? Um, what the heck did I say to him? Um, I said, um, Rollins wins the briefcase, cashes in on, cashes in, in the, the main event, Wins it from Edge. SummerSlam. Edge versus Rollins for the Universal title. And a no disqualification match. It books itself. I mean, that match actually books itself with no title on the line. Seth Rollins tried to break Edge's neck seven years ago in 2014 on, on Raw. He put his head on the briefcase right there and tried to curb stomp him into the ground. Perfect. So... My so uh, uh, Rey Mysterio and Dominic are gonna win the tag team uh, are are gonna retain the SmackDown tag team titles. Rollins or Big E is gonna win the briefcase, or I could see Riddle winning and then go over to Raw. I mean, go into Raw. Randy Orton is coming in on Monday. Hey. Good job, but you but you took my spot in the match. No, no, don't worry, Randy, bro. I'll just hand you the I'll just hand you the briefcase because we're bros. And then Randy Orton t takes the briefcase from Riddle. I could see that happening if, if Riddle wins it. Just please don't do what Riddle... Just please don't do with Riddle what you did with Otis if Riddle wins this. So, Big E or Seth Rollins is going to win the briefcase. 
Um, Liv Morgan is going to win the um, is going to win the women's Money in the Bank. Bobby Lashley is winning the WWE title. Ripley is retaining. I'm 50-50 on Roman and Edge, and AJ and Almost are, are going to retain. Those are my predictions. Peace out.